We got a problem. The kitchen ceiling is leaking. There's a bathroom above. So let's take the knobs off of the shower to see if any of the stems are leaking. If not, let's see if there's an access panel. Usually it's hidden in a closet. Once you find it, open it up and you should be able to see the back side of your shower and your bathtub drain pipe. With good lighting, you should be able to locate the source of the leak. In this case, is the drain from the bathtub leaking at the junction below. The bathtub drain and the overflow are connected to a U-shaped drain trap. In this case, there's a compression nut and a compression ferrule. And that's where the leak has occurred because the compression ferrule has dried out and cracked. When locating your leak, it might be useful to use your smartphone's camera and stick it into the hole. I was able to replace the seal without cutting a hole in the kitchen ceiling. In doing so, you have to remove the compression nut first and use sandpaper to sand away the corrosion. This is a great automotive sealant that I have used on my car projects, but it also works very well on home plumbing applications. We use a sealant to replace the compression ferrule. Apply sufficient sealant around the pipe before tightening the compression nut. For additional safety, you can put sealant outside of the nut as well. Lastly, you can use drywall filler to patch the spot where the water damage has occurred. There you go, you just saved yourself a couple hundred bucks.